Welcome back YouTube to Be It, day number 58. Today's Be It is a beauty. It's from Badger's Brewery or whatever. It's a thirst quencher. It's called the Thirsty Ther Ferret. Oh yeah, they see they spell thirsty. Thirsty with an F. And here, give it a go. Got a bargain today, picked up a computer for 20 bucks, nothing wrong with it. Oh, you can actually smell it. Whew. A bit about it, it's, um, um, well, they got a bit of a yarn on the back. It's at the heart of a countryside village can be found at an inn. A place where locals go to relax after a long day. In one such inn, rumour has, has it that inquisitive ferrets would sneak into the back door and cheekily sample the local brew. Eh. The old ferrets were getting pissed. It's, uh, it's about one point, it's four and a half percent alcohol. It's uh, very, it smells, I don't know, fucking strong. Got, I don't know, it's definitely bitter, but it ain't that bitter. And, um, <laughs> you shut the door if you want. And, um, yeah, just fucking tastes a bit malty, sweet, bit of the orange zest there. Balance not too bad overall. I've got a few things in this beer reading on the back, and um, it's definitely not a spicy hop. Tiny bit sweet, but it's pretty good balanced. Um, we'll pour it in the skin and glass for you so you can see. Give it a good, I'll give it a good head for you anyway. I'll learn how to pour one of these beers one day. Just a light goldy brown colour. It's um, definitely not a straw colour. It's on the tinge of a light copper. And for a lager, it's not too bad. It's bloody... Give it another... I'd have to give it a pass three and a... Three and a half, nearly four. Again, for the old thirsty badger. I just thought everything that's put in it just works works in well, so if you want to try lager beer and you're not quite used to it, this is definitely on the easy side and it's not so bitter. Okay to drink. Yeah, I picked it up at Dan Murphy's, I don't know, for about four bucks for the bottle or something like that, so wherever you get it from. Anyhow. Just remember to drink responsibly or not. And um, most importantly, be kind to one another. We'll catch us on the flip side tomorrow with another beer.